I agree that men have it harder when it comes to dating these days. But in cases when they have it easier, they act just as arrogant as the women who have it easy when it comes to dating, if not more. Why do you think there were men like Rush Limbaugh or Tom Likas who fat shamed women for not being perfectly thin despite being fat themselves? They know that women find them physically repulsive, but when they became rich and were able to pay for sex easily, they developed a sense of ego. It doesn't fucking matter if you think I'm ugly. Having options and being ugly, two totally different things because I am a man who has options himself. And look at the jocks or the chads. Even though they represent a minority of the male population, they tend to be arrogant as well. They tend to pump and dump women they get with, or they stay with them a little longer, but they are never committed. I don't see these guys complaining about hookup culture, and I'm sure all you males on YouTube who do wouldn't either if it was working in your favor. You know the phrase, I'll still hit if I could. Then you have all these guys who were atheists and were pro-pornography who didn't care that much about abortion just 10 years ago. And they'll shame any feminist who spoke out against pornography. They'll accuse anti-porn activists like Andrea Dorkin of being jealous of hot women. But after the Trump era started, suddenly there were so many young men who became conservative pro-life Christians who claim to hate hookup culture and claim to hate pornography and that they hate it that some women use OnlyFans these days. The truth is, men are hypocrites. Men don't have better sexual morals than women do. Human males are just like their chimpanzee counterparts when it comes to this. Men are opportunists just like they accuse women of being. They'll crisscross over ideologies. They'll support whatever side they think benefits themselves the most. If they aren't benefiting, they'll be whining about hookup culture. They'll be complaining about modern women being whores. They'll advocate for banning abortion and even contraceptives. And they'll say that we need to go back to a more traditional society, like in the times where women didn't have rights. But when they are benefiting from this modern hookup culture, they'll be acting like man whores. They'll be bragging about how much pussy they are getting. They'll care way less about abortion or will even encourage the woman they slept with to get one. They'll be way less likely to want to have a so-called traditional nuclear family, and they'll be much more likely to be in favor of pornography. Again, men are hypocrites. One thing they are consistent with is their disrespect and mistreatment of women, just in different ways, depending on how good they have it in the dating world, or how obsessed with sex they are.